Emergency officials in Missouri say it's likely more levees will fall victim to the Mississippi River. Three broke Thursday in the Show Me State, including this one in Winfield. The breaks send water gushing toward homes and farm fields. Officials say those levee breaks are actually lowering crest predictions downstream since tens of thousands of gallons of water won't be flowing south. Midwesterners along the Mississippi are doing what they can to fight the floodwaters, but it is an uphill battle. This man in Foley says he's moved to a tent on his roof. He says from there he can keep a better eye on his property. Upriver in Iowa, the waters are receding. That's where President Bush went on Thursday to see the devastation. And he wasn't the only politician checking out the damage. Republican presidential hopeful John McCain also got a personal tour of the mess in Columbus Junction. Meanwhile, a couple in that Iowa town decided the high water couldn't spoil their plans to tie the knot. Curtis White is in the Iowa National Guard. He's on flood duty. He and his fiance don't live in Columbus Junction, but they decided to move their Wednesday wedding so it could happen when it was planned. Of course, how it actually yes, happened was a lot different than how it was planned. Ritter walked up Highway 92 instead of a church aisle, and the National Guard chaplain presided over the ceremony. Judy Boisha, The Associated Press.